Welcome to Surgical Instruments Series Part 03. Today our topic is Obstetrical Instruments. Obstetrical instruments and their use in veterinary obstetrics is very important topic to learn the uses of obstetrical instruments in detail. Cervix dilator. Used for dilation of the cervix in partially dilated cases at the time of parturition. Uterine dilator. Used for the dilatation of uterine lumen in difficult birth. Whelping forcep. Used for delivering the pups during difficult parturition in bitch. Vaginal speculum. Used for examination of the vaginal mucous membrane and the OS externus for presence of any abnormal discharge, pus, trauma, laceration, adhesion, growth and other congenital defects etc. in the birth canal and also for insemination or medication in small animals. Eye hook. These can be sharp or blunt. Sharp eye hook is used in dead fetuses while blunt eye hook is used in the live fetuses. Eye hook is attached to a snare and is applied at the inner canthus of eye of the fetus. Camera's detorsion fork. It is used to rotate the fetus along its longitudinal axis in cases of uterine torsion. Fetotomy wire. It is the wire used to saw the fetus, hence, also named as wire saw. Approximately 10 feet of wire is used at one time for the amputation of fetal part. Calving rope. Used for applying traction on fetal parts at the time of calving. Farrowing forceps. Ordinary type. Used for delivering the fetus at parturition in the saw. Moore's chain. These are used to apply traction on the fetal part. Snare introducer. Used for introducing snare around the different part of the fetus at the time of handling the dystocia. Muir's chain handle. It is used to apply traction on the chains. Cray Schottler hook. It is used to apply traction when no fetal extremity is available. Always apply it on the bony portion of the fetal body after fixing it with a snare. HK calf puller. It is used to pull the calf during dystocia. Thigazin's fetatome. It is in two separable pieces with two barrels for the wire saw. The two parts can be separated, cleaned and boiled easily in the sterilizer. Guarded embiotome. These are used to make incisions on the fetus within the uterus to drain fluid or gas for reduction in size and easy delivery in acidic, anasarca or emphysematous fetuses. Gunther's finger knife, used for intrauterine embryotomy operation. William's long obstetrical hook, used for embryotomy operation. For getting hold on the fetal part where hand cannot reach and the surface are slippery. It can be applied on head, palatine arch, spine and pelvis. Kuhn's crutch repeller. It is used to repel the fetus in the uterus to create space for easy manipulation of the fetus. Uterine scissor, used for intrauterine surgical interventions like removal of tumors, fibrous bands, adhesions, etc.